Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Broke Man's Road to Glory. We did not do great in rank and uh, division rivals this week because of finals and so on. But things would be, uh, it's going to be changing real soon, uh, which is going to be really fun. But we did get division three uh, rival rewards. We get two consumer packs and two mega packs. Um, but just fine. Oh. We made adjustments, Division. Oh, shoot. Okay. <laughs> that was... That's weird. Okay. Uh, I... Okay, so there's changes. Alright. Let's actually discuss this real quick. So... Okay. Division 10. Tier 4. Option 1. Before was uh, one gold premium pack. Now it's two gold premium pack, but the same amount of coins. Before for division nine. Oh, so they only they only changed certain ones. Okay, so division nine. Before uh, was um, oh option one for tier two. Six gold premium jumbo gold jumbo packs, uh, and two consumables. Now it's six. Oh, jumbo gold packs and four consumables. Dang. I mean, it's not great packs, but that's a lot of packs. <laughs> that's a small. It's it's a kind of a decent opportunity to pack something. Great. Okay. Then option three is three three gold premium jumbo packs and one consumable. Now it's two consumables. Then we go down to division three, where it starts to get very important. Option one of tier two. Before was two mega packs, two prime mix weather packs, and two wow dang two gold <laughs> premium uh, jumbo packs, and 250 uh, foot champ points. Now okay, two rare mega packs, two prime mix, two gold premium, and four jumbo. Cool. That's the thing. Why are those two untradeable and the other two are not? I say I, I'm I'm a, I'm a decent player on this game, but because of I'm not able to play, I'm, I haven't reached that point yet. So I don't honestly know how this works. But there's you get two untradeable sets of packs and then two tradable sets of packs. That's I, that's pretty cool in all honesty. Uh, for option one, I would actually take that every time. Um, okay, and option three would be uh, before is one rare mega pack, one prime mix players pack, and then one jumbo gold pack. And now it's one, one, oh, and two, so they just added an extra pack. Then we go down, there's a lot. Division three, option three is four, two, to four, two, what? Oh. Four mega packs that are untradeable. Oh, okay. They just fixed that issue. Uh, Division 2, Tier 3. Option 1, two rare player packs. Huh. And one mega pack. Now it's one rare player pack and one electro. That kind of sucks. Uh, us for option 1. Option 2 is four rare player packs. Yeah, to two rare. Whoa, they kind of downgraded it. They even took out, so they took out two 50k packs and two mega packs. Yeah, and and, and they replace it with a two rare electron players back. So they take away four packs, 100k because of 50k each, and then I don't know, I think mega packs are 35. They take away those for the electron players back, which I honestly don't remember how much they are. They are rare though, which is okay, but. Still, huh? You took away two 50k packs. Huh. Division 2 Tier 1. Before was one mega pack, two rare mix players pack, one rare mega pack. Now it's two mega packs, one. So the only difference is one rare mix players pack got taken away. Huh. Option 3. Before was two mega packs, four rare mix players pack. Two rare mega packs. Now it's four, two, two. 
So they give so they took away two rare mix players packs, but they added two mega packs. Huh. There was some improvements there and there, but then when it started to get down to like here where they start taking away um, 50k packs, especially for the higher um, divisions, kind of sucks for um, the higher division players. So that's that's a little sad, but yeah, we're actually going to open up the packs and then start marking matchups and whatever else SBCs that just come out. So I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. These two packs right here, the Jumbo Premium Gold 26 pack and the Premium Gold pack was actually from uh, me winning the whole entire single player draft. Just um, attempting to, you know, I just, I just did it just for the heck of it. Um, I'm actually in foot champs. I'm only going to play a few games because I do have to study my butt off. But I am attempting to, to see, like, where I'm at. I'm one and one right now. Um, the reason why I lost the first game, actually, and it's not an actual excuse, it's just being honest I lost them penalties I really suck at penalties and that's something I do need to work on definitely um, I was up 4-2 the whole time and then um, towards the last like 15 minutes of the game my defense just broke apart and I, I, I didn't really have answers for his two goals to tie up the game then it kind of became a stalemate for uh, throughout overtime but the um, the game, the other game I actually won, I won by a last minute goal, well, it was like the 85th minute, scored a goal, um, we were tied 1-1 for a while, and that happened. Um, there's a lot of stuff that actually came out, uh, weekly objectives and stuff like that, and also uh, the La Liga uh, player of the season, which I will actually do, maybe not in this episode, but the following episode. But the only thing we're going to do is actually open up these packs. Get marquee matchups going, and then the next episode we'll be opening the rest of the packs and doing SBCs and so on and so forth. So we're just gonna jump right into it, and let's get ahead. Let's go ahead. Let's get this this ball rolling. So no walkout. Can we see boards? No boards. Now uh, we do have a few things to discuss, especially about um, today, the team of the group stage play. Oh, we got David Villa. Um, the team of the group stage players that are um, out and they're just awesome cars they, they look amazing and I hopefully I have the opportunity to possibly get one uh, we're actually going to do this real quick so next episode we will actually do towards goal and from the spot and then whatever else SBC that comes out within the next uh, day or so uh, before the squad battles a uh, normal video I do every uh, week so we're actually going to do the marquee matchups right now Juventus versus Inter which actually at the moment from my recording we're up 1-0 one, 1-0 one uh, because of Mandzukic we got a header and this is exactly what I did so I went Serie A at the bottom from set, both center mid down to the defense and goalkeeper on oh, actually the right mid then left mid to uh, center tech man to the strikers I did uh, Bundesliga to be able to get this pack you just want to be able to make sure you get some decently um, you, you get some um, hard links then we go Al how you say Al, Al Helal versus uh, Al Nasser Nasar um, basically you go Saudi Arabia on the right or left if you're choosing then you just want to get some good strong links to be able to get enough cam and this was a little difficult just because I haven't been able to do the bronze pack method which will be changing when vacation comes up for me in um, less than a week which is going to be cool um, then we jump into uh, Liganes vs uh, Getafe so right here I did a league 2 no, um, the second Spanish league on the left side right, right side or right mid center mid and the strikers with the chinese league then the right the right back and center back to be able to get a strong link of the netherlands league the adversity so we submit all that oh no no we still got one more my apologies we got chelsea versus men united oh <laughs> forgot to do it so we're gonna go ahead and do it right now see so why not right actually no i'll be right back let me do it real quick all right guys we're back this is really easy to do uh, left back all the way around to right mid. I did my Bundesliga and then I got some decent links uh, from goalkeeper and the center backs. These were honestly the only players I had from um, packing uh, that, that's that's uh, untradeable or that I just packed. 
So we're actually going to be able to complete this marquee matchup, Electrum Players Pack. Hopefully we're able to get some nice, and then the nice thing is we get three player UCL, UCL three player pack, and uh, a rare gold pack. Yeah, and that will be probably completed on the next episode. But as of right now, we have 10 packs. Uh, let's go ahead and let's open up these silvers. Maybe I shouldn't have. Because I might not have room. <laughs> that was a mistake. A mistake, mistake, mistake. Maybe we're okay. Alright, we got a whole bunch of contract. We get some squad fitness. Oh, we get... Is that... Oh, that's a Barcelona player. Shoot. Okay. I think we'll be our... Oh, no, no, no. I actually like holding on to those. Because there are actually... There are people that still enjoy using those. Um, so I go ahead and sell them to be able to get some. I'm gonna hold on to a silver pack then. Uh, rare consumables pack. we just go ahead and open these real quick. And uh, whatever I don't fit, like whatever that um, I'm not able to open because of the transfer list at the moment, um, I'll use those in the following episode when I finish up the rest of the SBCs. So I think that's how we're looking at it. But we're gonna go ahead and open up the mega packs next and then go from there. Oh, we uh, what do we unlock? A gold pack. That's not bad. All right, and then that can go discarded. Oh yeah, these are untradeable. All right, so the mega packs are actually untradeable. Also, uh, okay, let's actually open up these first. No, no, gold pack. All right, let's see. So no walkout. Can we get a board from a normal gold pack? No, we do not. <laughs> okay. Now that I can get discarded. That has to go up there. That's great. <laughs> now we're down to 97. This is just... No, no, no. We're just going to open up the mega packs. It's fine. Let's, go. let's, let's just... Let's just go ahead and open these. Oh, all right. So no walk out. We get the blue little flare stuff to go. We do get a board though. French goalkeeper. Amandana? Yeah, Amandanda. That's not bad. 83. Add on to the pile of 83s I have. Oh, and he's in a he's trade. Oh, that's just great. Alright, we get a lot of squad fitness cards, that's what I like to see. Okay. Please tell me it's... Alright, cool. Alright. Nope. Yep. Alright. So it's just uh, Sergu, which I would not just throw away. So, um, why not? Let's just, let's just go ahead and do one of the SPCs then. Uh, to be able to get rid of some of these players so let's go ahead and let's open up the towards goal and i'm actually going to do it in front of you so two rare players minimum leagues two okay so first we want to get cerebro oh my gosh <laughs> all right cerebro all right cool then we're gonna well, those three nationalities so we want to go Serie A. And we want to go there. And I believe it's um all just gold. So it's fine. Okay, we want to go to Nelly actually. And then, um, no, yeah, Brazil actually. That would make it a little bit easier. Okay, so we need at least two. Oh, that's, yeah, we're good. I don't think we have a left back. We need a Brazilian left back. We don't have that. Do we have a Brazilian right back? We do not. All right, what about a Brazilian center midfielder? That's not that's very expensive. We do we have a lot actually. Okay, we got some French links right here. And then we want to go into, we can go, we could do that. I know I do need another nationality and I don't want to do that left wing I don't want to do that Chinese league 
Oh, yeah, I see the, I see the issue there. Okay. So we're going to do that. Then we're going to add a uh, Chinese league or league one. So league one or the Chinese. No, we'll probably go league one. That probably, yeah, there we go. All right. So then we do this. Okay. I thought, okay. So then we have everything. We just need a rare player. So the only thing I need to do is get a normal gold rare player. Because I believe... 85 cam. Huh. That's fine. And then, um, I'll do this. Let's see. Well, I might have to get rid of Hulk. That's the way it's looking. Oh, I need a rare player anyway. So it ends up working out, I guess. Yep. Alright, cool. So we submit this in. And we actually get a UCL 3 player pack, which I believe that means we have an opportunity to actually pack one of the top end players. Um, and while we're at it, let's just, let's just do this. <laughs> I have changed my mind on the spot. Okay, so we need Liverpool. Oh, we also need... Okay. So we want to go special. I want to use the... Wait, is there a rating? No. But I do need a league that I'm able to work around. And I think that's the card. Okay. Oh, exactly three nationalities. Never mind. Okay, then I need to see... Um, Liverpool and Napoli players we actually have. Wait, actually, it's... Yeah, it doesn't matter. Okay. So I'll use him. That's fine. Uh, do we also have the Irish player, but I don't want to use him. Okay, we're going to go to Napoli and see what we have. Okay, we have to, we have this Frenchman right here. My coit, which could actually work. Not three nationalities, so that means I need to go French on this side. French on this side. Um, oh yeah, I can. Yeah, I can do this, but he might actually be worth something. Five hundred. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Frenchman. That's the center back. Yeah, that's cool. Right there. Okay, we need a goalkeeper. Okay. Yeah, French too. This what I like saying. All right. Okay. Now the thing I need to do is um special. Special car. We do have a Frenchman right here actually that could work. Oh. Okay. We need three nationalities, so I can go um English left back. Perfect. That's League 2 though. And League 1. Do we have any left wings? English 2. And I... Oh, he's untradeable. That's fine. Okay. We're very close to camp. But I need three... Other, other nationalities. So let me see what there is. That's a midfielder. Just French. I think I can pull this off like this. Right wing. And then I need a midfielder. A oh, shoot. A midfielder. That has to work. Yeah. And then, um, striker for League One. That works. 
problem is is this but I have so many untradeable <laughs> position cards ends up working out <laughs> so there we go we just utilize what we had and there we go we can actually get a rare gold player pack gold pack I'm sorry rare gold pack that's that was not that bad all right cool all right before we actually just end the rest of the episode which is packs um we're actually let's just talk about the weekly objectives up for a moment uh so team of the group stage which i will actually do this <laughs> even though i have the weekend league and so on and so forth i do have to play some rival games so i do need to have eight wow eight separate rival wins we're scoring with the italian player so that means i have Bellotti. So he would be out scoring at least eight goals um, and eight wins, a goal per game at least. I mean, if he gets two goals in one game, it doesn't really help. So I need eight rival wins. Then from here, because uh, I want Perolo, then uh, win 12 online matches. Okay. And then score twice in 10 separate wins this week. Okay. And then you score. You Oh, great. Score using La Liga players in four separate rival wins. Ah, okay. And then uh, win three squad battle matches by two goals on minimum. And then score uh, two online single matches to get rare consoles back. Oh, and then uh, assist through four, using through balls and four separate matches to get a center forward to camp position. The, uh, these challenges are going to be a little tough, to be honest with you. Huh. Well... It is what it is. Let's um. I I'm not gonna have any room. Actually, uh, let, let me let me let me do my trick real quick. Um, I think I use Lingard. Uh, I haven't really cleaned out this, so let, let me just do this real quick. So this this is the fun trick that I figured out uh, to be able to just to clear stuff hopefully all of you are having a good day um, I actually did want to talk about uh, one thing that's happening with FIFA um, so last episode we talked or I'm sorry just a few minutes ago we talked about the division rival rewards and um, when I did see him it kind of just flew over my head but it seems like there is going there is an issue with you know having the rewards how it is um after i really took a chance and look at looking at them you could be in division five and just have great rewards <clears throat> without even trying to get to division one that's that's one issue that i do see i mean when you expect the higher you go up the higher better cards you want to get so i mean the idea of how come the best players only get the best cards and then you and then you uh, p players who are somewhat mediocre like myself that do want better packs but don't expect better players to be in our divi our division we actually want to play with players who uh, are at our level to get better at this game so the, but the thing is you can't have both because there are going to be better players that I believe Nepenthes talked about this where there's going to be players in Division 1 that sees this just see, sees um, Division 5 or Division 3 or all the, all the other divisions where it's like I don't really have to play a lot to be able to get all these types of packs so that's that's probably one that's one issue I'm having with EA that I don't understand why they can't really think about what's happening uh, with the reward system but if they believe anything my, my thing has always been to be, just be able to communicate with your consumers well, whoever it is so if you're going to be putting a new uh, update or whatever there's really no communication it's just written things like like I know 2k NBA 2k for my other series uh, for basketball they actually had a voice uh, Ronnie 2k he used to actually um talk with the community a lot he's not doing as much anymore and i really don't know the reason why but that was one thing i did appreciate from 2k is that the communication to the consumers to us and i know that's as different companies 2k sports and so on but i've actually had ea games since i was
probably yeah ps1 i've had i've always had ea games and they've always been somewhat consistent with communicating but for some odd reason i don't know why there's no communicating at all um we get nothing here we get satinal uh Bilana. yeah but there hasn't been really no real communication between um, the consumers and them so I honestly don't know how they're thinking what they're thinking and look if they have a reason to do whatever they want to do that's fine but my thing is oh great uh, to actually give a reason ju just so people can communicate if their mindset is uh, thinking a certain way it's fine let let them do whatever they want the only thing I would want is just a, um, I just would love for them to communicate with us somehow some way and um, that would be really appreciative uh, actually we have four more packs to open but th there is a dilemma I am stuck again so we're actually so I said we we're just going to do we're going to separate them um, we're actually going to go ahead and just do the the Liga book basically Jinek we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna go ahead and go away no we're actually going to wait to do this the squad battles actually yeah we'll do that so we're actually going to end the episode there uh, the four extra packs we do have I will do for the next episode or yeah I'll, I'll wait to the next episode to actually um, do that. So yeah, I appreciate y'all listening. I appreciate y'all watching. My apologies with the for the long episode, but yeah, I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.